New tonight at 11 in the past two weeks, Clarence Fire has responded to two house fires, one of which was deadly. Good evening. I'm Scott Levin and I'm Mary Alice Stemler. Tonight we're hearing from investigators about the origins of that fire and what you can do to keep your family safe this holiday season. Two on your sides. Andy Payton joins us from the newsroom with more. Andy Scott and Mary Alice just within the past few hours we have learned that the two fires shared a similar origin stemming from the home's fireplace, causing first responders tonight to urge residents to think of fire safety in these winter months. Anytime we have an incident where we can't change the outcome, you know, it's it's difficult to handle. Two weeks later in Clarence Fire Chief Brett Hanford still struggles yeah. with what he saw. Yeah, so I get choked up every now and then uh, talking about that. So on November 26, Hanford's team responded to a three alarm fire on Spalding Drive in Clarence that had engulfed the home. I, I've never seen that much fire in an occupied structure. 62 year old Joan Wozer and her four dogs didn't make it. Can't stress enough making sure that the chimneys are clean, uh, they're properly inspected. Tonight, investigators revealing the fire started in the house's fireplace and spread due to an issue with the chimney. The same origin as another fire in Clarence early Monday morning after the homeowner reported fire extending out of their fireplace. Clarence Fire arriving on scene and extinguishing the fire before any further damage. We always promote smoke detectors, you know, change your clocks, change your batteries. The recent fires bringing the focus to fire safety this time of year, with experts reminding residents of preventative measures such as checking smoke detectors, chimneys, and making sure to place heat sources like space heaters at least 10 feet away from live trees. Measures Chief Hanford says can't be understated to keep you and your family safe this holiday season. Just make sure uh, everybody has a plan, you know, um, make sure they understand what the smoke detector sounds like. And when that happens, when that goes off, know what to do. Now for those making their way to the tree lots this time of year, experts also advise keeping your evergreen watered as that will reduce the likelihood of starting a fire in the newsroom and on your side tonight. Andy Payton, Channel 2 News.